Good afternoon, all. Well, I was summoned today by Dr. Drew Pinsky. And again, he told me I had to get an important message out to many people, especially in California. Uh, Pinsky said bubonic plague, also known as the Black Death, a pandemic that killed off millions in the 14th century, is likely already present in Los Angeles. The plague is spread by infected fleas and exposure to bodily fluids from a dead plague infected animal, a rat. With the bacteria entering through the skin and traveling to your lymph nodes, typhus, which broke out in the city last year will likely return, Pinsky said. Already, a Los Angeles police officer had contracted typhoid fever, which infects fewer than 350 Americans each year. The various types of typhus are caused by a bacterial infection and spread by body lice, chingers, or fleas. In the 1600s, the disease decimated Germany. I also believe it did damage also in Britain. This is unbelievable, Pinsky said. I can't believe I live in a city where this is not third world. This is medieval, Pinsky said, according to Fox News. Third world countries are insulted if they are accused of being like this. No city on earth tolerates this. The entire population is at risk. Pinsky said the city simply can't handle the demand for services, noting that now there are so many homeless people. And because of the homeless people that are living in tents and boxes, they are now having a big surge of rats and you see what happens with rats they bring in the fleas then the people get bit also people are eating food and trash in the streets that could also have been nibbled on by the rats this is sad people sad and i think what's worse is to know that we got two politicians that I know of, Nancy Pelosi and Maxine Waters that lives in that area. I don't know how people don't summons them to a town square in the middle of the town. Now, what should happen there is many people should tell them what's going on. I'm sure many people might want to throw things at them. But you know, it's sad because the way I see it, they're taking your money, your gold, treating you guys as if you're peasants, treating you guys as if you are from this time. Back in medieval times when many people, because of sanitation, hygiene, water, so many things, Diseases. Is this what we really want, guys? Is this what San Francisco wants? Let alone, not just that. What about all the drugs and the needles? Okay, people are going to get more disease. Does anybody ever wonder? Okay, didn't we go through AIDS? Do you remember the epidemic of AIDS? Isn't it the same or maybe a little different, but it's still bodily fluid? What's the difference now? People are getting bit. Rodents laying dead in the street. It's very sad. Very sad, guys. And I think it's more of a disgrace to know 
that Nancy Pelosi and Maxine Waters, as rich as they are, should be helping, helping these poor people so nobody gets any type of disease. Nobody should be living in the streets. Nobody should have to eat from trash, let alone share it with rodents, rodents that have fleas. That's what's happening. And Dr. Drew Pinsky is absolutely correct. And it is a concern. This isn't a joke. It's not a joke, guys, at all. And you know what? They need to be brought out into the town square and stripped of their duties. That's what needs to happen. If they want to continue to have people live like this while they get rich, there they are, sitting at their dinner table eating and looking at all the gold that they have and all the wealth while people are getting sick. But then what do they care? They only care about bringing more people in, more people from the southern border. And who knows what diseases they're bringing in, believe me. This is not a joke. Not a joke what Dr. Drew Pinsky is talking about. And you know what? We're seeing it, guys. We're seeing. We're seeing all these medieval diseases that are going to come back. And why? We shouldn't have to have this. Nancy Pelosi. Maxine Waters. That's why there should have been term limits. If there was term limits, they would be gone already. Instead of getting rich off the land and just caring about bringing more people in so they get more votes while people are dying now. They're dying. They're getting sick. Sad. I don't know how anybody, all the people in California, it don't matter what party you're in, Democrat, liberals, Republicans, independents, you should all be in an uproar. Why should people live like that? Why should you have to walk down the street and see dead rats, dead people, people pooping, crapping, peeing, needles, children stepping on needles in a park, playing a game? How is that possible? It's disgraceful. I'm telling you, disgraceful, guys. And it's sad. And Dr. Drew Pinsky is absolutely right. It's not a joke. You know what? Bring them two down to the town square. Have them sit there and be stripped of their dignity. And let them hear the people say, no more. No more. We don't want this no more. Or you know what? Pick up those rats and throw them at their house. That's what I would do. Pick up those needles, pick the trash up, and put it at their house. How about that? Yep, it's sad. It's not a joke.